In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can fly just like this. Place a blank scene on the bottom and you jumping on the top. Add a cut when you're at your highest point of your jump. Then right click and add frame hold to freeze that moment in time. Click effect controls, then the free draw bezier tool. Draw a mask around yourself, like you're playing connect the dots around your body, and nest it. In the effect panel, search for the transform effect and drop it on there. Click this clock next to the position in the transform effect controls to add the start of an animation. Go forward a few frames and move yourself upward. Deselect use composition shutter angle and type a number in there. The higher the number, the more blur you'll have. Go to where you start to jump, right click, show clip keyframes, time remapping, and speed. Click the dot to add a keyframe. To the right of the keyframe you just added, pull the line upward to increase the speed. To make the speed ramp up, drag this line out. Then just drop in some stock footage of the ground breaking below your feet, add in some smoke, use a camera shake preset, or create your own by nesting all the clips together and adding the transform effect. Go frame by frame to add some shake to the camera. Blast off. Zip by a building, copy the original nested sequence of you jumping in the air, paste it in front of the building, then animate your position, rotation, and scale to move across. To land, you're gonna do the same process you did to take off, but in reverse. Go to the highest point of a jump, add a cut, mask it, nest it, and then animate it to come in from up high, have it connect to the other clip, add in some more stock footage of the ground baking and some dust, and you're done. <laughs> 